uh, you see, we, we did so many views now because we did the upper um, uh, esophageal views, we did uh, aortic valve, we did inflow outflow, by cable, all the mitral, the mo most important mitral views, and then left atrial appendage views. And now we can uh, perhaps move to transgastric. Yeah. So let's go to zero now. Mm -hmm. And go deeper in the esophagus. Good. So now I will uh, just make it a little smaller. And uh, here's, here's the current position and the orientation of the, of the plane. Do you think it's really short axis view? Not really. No, because it's not round. Yeah? It is ellip elliptic. So what to do to make it round? Wait a second, I will just show it here. You see, it's, it's not round. So what to do? Flex a little bit. Yeah, but the question is retro or anti? Can you show from the bottom once, once again? Yeah, so you have to section the ventricle. Yes. More like this. Okay, so, so mm -hmm. you want to be more perpendicular to the long axis view of the left ventricle in this case. So you have to use antiflex to really show short axis. And then you can enter deeper and again antiflex. Good. And you see now the tips of the mitral leaflets. Yeah, you see it here. And when you uh, keep it flexed, Okay. And here you see the leaflets. Yeah. Then you can uh, go deeper. But the question is, shall we go deeper with this antiflex uh, uh, bent now? It no. causes some harm to the patient. As okay. A so, so my advice would be to release the antiflex. Go, deeper go slightly deeper, like mm -hmm. two centimeters, and antiflex once again. And then it's safe, but at the same time you get the perfect images. However, if you are slightly deeper, you can actually a little bit pull slowly and go back to the mitral. Yeah? So this is uh, the way how you can precisely locate your plane uh, along the left ventricular axis, but perpendicular to this axis. So. Uh, if you do the antiflex, so, so this is the uh, transgastric basal view, where is the mitral valve, then release, go deeper, and show the papillary muscle level, okay, good, and now release, go deeper, and show the apical level, yes, release, go, go even deeper, and once again, you see, this is the, the, the very apex, apical part, release a little bit, okay? Yeah, this is very ap apical part of the left ventricle. Mm -hmm. So when we are here in, at the level of the mitral, do the antiflex now, please. Uh, we can once again use the 90 degrees view to show the long, the, the, the two chamber view, which is the longitudinal section of the ventricle. So let's do it. Yeah go immediately to 90. Yes, very good. And now slightly correct. Okay, so this is more or less the long, the, the, the two chamber view we call it, because this is not really the long axis view. This would contain aorta. But here also you can see the left atrial appendage and the mitral valve and also papillary muscles.